What's going on, Lead Gen Beast? It's your boy, Matty Ice Leads for Locals. I'm really excited to bring this video to you because I just found what I believe is the best Facebook interest targeting tool on the market, period. If you're a digital marketing agency or a small business owner, whatever, um, and you run Facebook ads on a regular basis, you have to have this in your business uh, because it shows you, uh, it gives you uh, Facebook interest that you didn't even know existed. Uh, I've done this in multiple in, uh, different industries so far, found tons of interest that I had no idea I could even target. So it's freaking awesome. So uh, let's dive into the video and let me show you how it works. All right, guys, let's rock and roll. I am really excited to share this tool with you because uh, so far, based on my experience, uh, this is definitely the best Facebook interest targeting tool that I have found. And I've tested this in a couple of different industries uh, so far, and it's I, I found uh, quite a few interests that I had no idea existed inside of Facebook that I, I didn't I, I didn't know I could target them. And that's really the, the point of this tool. It's called Audiencer. And um, uh, in this video, I just I want to show you guys the, ba the, the basics of how it works. It's actually really easy to use. So uh, if you're running Facebook ads on a regular basis and you want to discover uh, a different interests, new interests that maybe you haven't targeted before, this is this is you have to have this tool in your business. It's, it's just a no brainer. Um, uh, not only is it really powerful, it's really cheap. Uh, you do a one time payment. There's no ongoing monthly fees or anything like that. Um, normally, it's one hundred ninety nine dollars one time. If you go through the link in the description, you'll actually get one hundred dollars off. When you create your account, uh, the offer will show up on your dashboard. You can take advantage of it there. So definitely recommend that. But um, I just want to show you guys how to how to use this uh, because this thing is really powerful. So if you've seen any of my other videos or been through any of my courses or anything, um, you know that I am not a fan of Facebook audience insights. I think it's pretty much useless. I never use it. Um, half of the interest in there are not even available to target on Facebook, which makes no sense to me at all. Uh, it's kind of a waste of time. But um, I am a fan of the suggestions box, okay? So if we go into the ads manager here, and uh, uh, just bear with me, I'm, I'm giving some context uh, on, on why this tool is so powerful and kind of a must have. So I, I love the suggestions box here. Um, the, I, I found a lot of interest using this, but uh, it is limited. And oftentimes like after the fifth or maybe 10th, depending on the, the industry, the fifth or 10th rec, uh, suggested, suggested interest uh, it's not really relevant anymore to what you typed in, okay? Um, so I'm gonna give you an example uh, in the insurance space. Uh, one, uh, a couple of interests that I found in the insurance space that, again, I didn't know was there. Uh, and you'll, you'll, know, you'll see that it's, it doesn't show up in the suggestions box. So this is really powerful, guys, because uh, oftentimes, I mean, you know, there, there's plenty of people to target on Facebook, obviously, but the more interest that you have available to you that are really targeted to your, uh, to your industry, the, the better, right? Obviously, it's just going to open up a lot more opportunity. Now, one of my, uh, well, so far, my favorite part of Audiencer is this niche explorer. This thing is really cool. You type your niche in and it gives a bunch of different recommended um, uh, interest. So, uh, and, and it kind of works like the suggestion box. Like if I type in life insurance, for example, so we'll stick with the insurance uh, example. All right. So I, I click on life insurance. Now, uh, again, you know, obviously it's not perfect, but again, I found multiple interests in here that I didn't know existed. Universal life insurance. I had no idea that existed inside of Facebook. So watch this. So if we go over to the ads manager and I type in life insurance, okay? These are the interests that I have always targeted for my insurance campaigns uh, from right from the suggestions box. And they, they work great. That's fine. But... Uh, I had no idea that other the, these other interests uh, actually exist. So now if we type, if we click on suggestions, uh, so we have term life insurance, that's fine. And the more of these that we click, uh, usually the more that come up, but not always. So uh, let, let's do whole life insurance. Now, if we scroll down, you'll notice that universal life insurance does not pop up here. And you see it's starting to get less relevant, less relevant, right? Less relevant. Right. The universal life insurance is not here. So that, that's one of the reasons why I have no idea that this even existed. Now, does this show up in audience insights? Maybe. Uh, I have no idea because, again, that, that I just think that tool is pretty much useless. But um, anyways, my point is uh, with with audience are here. I, uh, again, if, so if we type in universal life insurance. Boom, there it is. 
It didn't show up in the suggestions box. Likely it doesn't show up in insights. And now I have a whole new uh, p uh, potential audience uh, to get in front of, 209,000. Not a crazy amount of people, but again, this is just one example. Um, another one that I found, uh, honestly, I can't even remember. Oh, you know what? I, I did a uh, I I search for mortgage. So let's search mortgage here really quick. Um, I found a uh, mortgage protection interest. Had no idea that existed. Um, did I do it right? Uh, let's see. Maybe not. Did I do mortgage loan? I can't remember which one I did. Yeah. Uh, yeah, here we go. Yeah, so I was just testing this in different, uh, for different industries. Oh yeah, right here, mortgage insurance. So uh, a lot of my uh, life insurance clients and students, they like to offer mortgage protection. Um, you know, we, we can stick with life insurance, term life and all that, but I had no idea mortgage protection or uh, mortgage insurance even existed. Now I gotta do my research on that and I gotta test it because that could mean, you know, just um, like, like traditional lenders mortgage insurance, right? It might not have anything to do with uh, um, mortgage protection, but uh, you know, it's a brand new interest that I can test 572,000 size. That's not too bad, you know? So um, the other example that, uh, that I, so where I, I know that this works is uh, in the lending space. So a lot of the loan interests that I use for my business loan clients and students, uh, I found those just doing my own research. It wasn't, it never showed up in the suggestions box. So uh, for like, for example, if we go, uh, let's narrow further here. So I'm just trying to, I'm trying to point out to you guys that there's a lot of interests that do not show up here. Okay, so if I type in loan, um, working capital, installment loan, things like that. Um, I think I think installment loan comes up. But like, look at this. You know, it's just um, there's there's not a lot of a lot of loan interest that come up here, right? So if I type, if we go back to audience here and I type in loan, give it a second. Okay, student loan. Didn't know that existed. Uh, loan origination, loan guarantee. Had no idea that was there. Loan word. I don't even know what that is. And um, uh, you can actually open this up. Uh, if we click right here, we can search this in Google. Uh, so if you're not sure what one of the um, what one of the interests are, then you can just do a quick search. Uh, is the word adopted from language? Uh, I, I don't know if this is relevant at all. Yeah, I don't know. But uh, my point is, uh, you you can search on Google. So like right here, installment loan. There it is. Secured loan. Uh, FHA insured loan, had no idea that existed. Term loan, uh, that one I knew. Fixed interest rate loan, did not know that existed. Now, again, some of these might be limited if you're in the special ads category, so that might be why I haven't found them before. But even still, guys, like, look at this. This is just nuts. <laughs> this is so freaking powerful. And what you wanna do is um, you can, uh, so you can create new audiences here. Um, you can also create projects. So if you have multiple different clients that you run ads for and uh, you wanna make sure you're staying organized, you can create projects. Uh, you create new audiences and you just hit this plus sign and you can add it to your audience. Uh, I might, I think it's because I already have this. In, uh, oh, no, there it is. Yeah. Uh, so it already, so it added it. Yeah. Uh, already exists. Anyways, um, you can add these to your audience. And then now um, the only uh, like a uh, con that I would give this, uh, the only downside is that you have to manually enter. Like once you build your audience, you have your list inside of Audiencer, you then have to manually put those into uh, your ads manager. It doesn't send those interests into your ad set. Um, that's really the only downside, but it, that for me, that's like nothing. That uh, it takes, you know, 30 seconds to put all of your interest into your ad set. So anyways, guys, I hope this was helpful. Uh, give me a, th uh, give the video a like if it was. Uh, leave a comment down below. What do you guys think about this tool? I, I, I think for a hundred bucks, insane value. It's it just an awesome offer. Um, so make sure you go through the link in the description, get your hundred dollar discount and uh, let me know what you guys think. Uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel, come out with this stuff all the time, constantly staying on top of digital marketing strategies, lead generation, different tools to help us uh, with our online marketing, all that stuff. So make sure you subscribe and uh, yeah, hope you guys are crushing it and I'll talk to you in the next video. Take care.